Good morning guys and welcome back to the channel. As you can see, we're at a different place than we usually are. We're at my dad's cabin. This is a place far into the woods that we're gonna explore a bit today and tomorrow. We're gonna fish a lake that I've caught a 10 kilo pike in today, which still has some ice on it because this is far up north. Hopefully we can crush the ice with the boat because it's open on some places. And the boat is standing ready. So now we're just gonna grab a coffee and then we'll go out. Okay, people, so uh, now we're in the car. About to head to the boat ramp. You can see that there's still some snow here. A couple of places. And actually the big lake that's uh, right next to the cabin has still a lot of ice on it. Uh, and the lake that we're supposed to fish at today had some ice on it yesterday when we checked it out. I think that it's possible to get the boat in and um, we'll have to go between the ice. <laughs> but we'll try. I think the best spots in the lake are open and I think it's possible to break the ice a bit with the boat as well. So we'll try it. <clears throat> now, uh, if you're wondering why we have a different car, it's because this boat ramp is not a boat ramp. <laughs> but as you can see, we still have some ice here. So hopefully we can get the boat in without a problem. Uh, but yeah, we'll see. I think it's fine. Hopefully. worked out <laughs> now we just have to be able to <laughs> get through this but I think we're gonna start fish here in the middle uh, between the ice and then we're gonna move outside because uh, last year I got a 10 kilo pike in the reeds out there so uh, it's springtime now as well so I think most of the fish in this lake are gonna be around this area because there's no other place for them to spawn so uh, hopefully we can catch a few. Let's go. So uh, we just started fishing now. I rigged up Isabelle's rod. Now I'm gonna rig my rod up with the same lure that I caught the big pike on in this lake last year. So uh, some nostalgia, but yeah, we'll try our best. So guys, we're just uh, moving all the time in this bay, trying to fish as much water as possible so we can try to find the fish. Because usually during spring as well, if you find one, you usually find a few more. So hopefully we'll find them soon. But right now we're fishing on 1.2 meters, I think. Isabel just caught her first fish of the day. It's a small perch, <laughs> uh, but at least it's something. We haven't had a single contact before this, so uh, I think we'll try a bit for perch now. Let's see if we can catch some perch then. I've actually never fished for perch up here at the cabin. Uh, since we haven't had any kind of contacts so far, we're gonna try to troll a bit, see if uh, they're out deep, and if we find any spots with a lot of bait fish or if we get a lot of bites, we can stop and spin or cast on them instead. But right, right now, all we've got is one perch. So we have to try something out. So uh, now we have four rods out. On the sonar it looks super nice because there's a ton of bait fish. So we'll try this for a while, then we're going uh, 
back to the boat ramp and we're gonna grill some sausage. We'll just do like two laps around this place, see if we can catch something. So guys, we just got the first fish for the day. Can we go to this one? It's not moving that much. <laughs> Fish. Fishy. Oh, like oh. The pike here are so beautiful. I'll show you. First fish of the day for me. It's a small little pike. I hope it's not peeing. Um, got it on trolling. It's the first fish, so uh, at least it's something. But look how beautiful these pike are. Insane. Such nice fish. It's a small one, but hopefully we can catch something more. Bang. Let's release her. And she's gone. Woohoo! Now we're taking a lunch break. Super slow fishing. We've caught one pike, one perch. Uh, it got a lot colder now, for some reason. As you can see, we don't have any sun anymore. But we're gonna start the grill, and we'll eat some sausage. Sausage, yeah. Ooh. And uh, after that, we might decide to switch lakes. We'll see. So I just dropped off my girlfriend because she was tired and frozen, <laughs> so she didn't want to fish anymore. But I'm gonna try another place, it's a bit different, the lake is a lot more shallow. I've heard from the locals around here that during ice fishing a lot of people fish for pike there and it's like 3 meters max depth. So hopefully the fish have uh, moved in there and uh, I can catch a few pike maybe. The previous lake sucked. Uh, but yeah, so uh, now I'm all alone. I'm gonna put the boat in the new lake and we'll try to catch some fish again. See you soon. Okay, new place. Gotta try it out. Let's go. So, uh, new spot. Boat is in the water. And now we're in a small canal. I'm not sure if there are any fish in here, but I'm gonna try a few casts just because. There's probably no fish here, but it's always fun to try. <laughs> but basically, this is a canal between two lakes. We've got this lake that's in front of me. It's super shallow. Uh, it's like three, three meters max depth. And the other one is, uh, I think it's 20 meters or something, but I've uh, fished quite a lot in the other lake. I haven't fished a lot in this lake here, but I figured we should try it out since we're only going to fish a few hours now. Okay guys, so uh, no luck right now. Sometimes you just think about why the fuck you are fishing. Holy shit, this is a hard day. Not really sure what I'm going to do. I think I'm gonna go to the other lake through the canal. Ooh. At least it's nice that I don't have a big boat. When it comes to this kind of fishing. So uh, this is uh, gonna be the last place because I'm about to give up. <clears throat> At least we tried. So we're gonna fish here and then we'll go under the bridge because I know it's a bit deeper there. And after that, we're gonna head home, take a sauna, eat some food, drink a few beer maybe. I think like the two or three previous times that I've been here, or the 
past two or three times that I've been here, we've caught like one fish a day. It's been a real struggle. I don't know if it's us who have been unlucky with the weather or if it's something else. I'm not sure, but something ain't right. And here I am fishing for 10 freaking hours. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> Honestly, I got a fish. What the heck? Yeah, it's a super small bike. But holy shit, I got a fish. Oh my god. I finally caught a freaking pike on casting. It's a super small one but they're so pretty in these waters. They're almost orange on the stomach. Okay guys, so uh, I'm out. <laughs> I'm done for the day guys. It's been rough, but yeah. So we'll go to the boat ramp and pack our stuff and head home and take a sauna and stuff instead. Let go. Back at the cabin. It was a rough day today. Two pikes, one perch. I don't know what happened. The pike seemed to be full spawn mode or something. Because uh, I saw a lot of pike that swam on the shallows. But couldn't catch them. So uh, I'm not sure what we're going to do tomorrow. Maybe fish for some perch or something. But guys, thank you so much for watching. I'm going to chill a bit in the sofa. Go to the sauna. Eat some dinner. But see you next time.